Alright guys, you are welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Charles Chinosu and in this video, I'll be showing you guys how to recover your hacked WhatsApp. How to recover your WhatsApp from hackers. And it could be that you are watching this video to prevent such in the future. Trust me, you are in the right place. I'll be showing you the necessary step you need to take for you to recover your WhatsApp from hackers. So I'll be very practical about this and I'll be using two of my phones so that you get to see how this works. So this particular phone you are seeing here is my personal phone why this one will be the hacker's phone so at this point this hacker is trying to like log into whatsapp with your phone number you might be curious how are they able to get your phone number it's just simple it could be from random groups you joined in the past and probably you are in the same group with some hackers and they get to access your phone number and now they are trying to hack you so after they've got your number they'll come to whatsapp and they'll click on agree to continue or agree and continue so they'll add your WhatsApp number over here. So once they add your number over here, they'll click on next. WhatsApp will ask them if this is the correct number and they'll click on yes. So can you see? It's asking for a code for them to log in. So at your own end, you'll be seeing this code and you'll be like, ah, uh -uh, I didn't request for this. How is this possible? So ensure you don't give out this code to anybody. Because at this point, they will try to call you and try to cajole you to give them the code. They could tell you that they are from WhatsApp or they are from somewhere, somewhere, just trying to convince you. They could tell you that they are the admin of a particular WhatsApp group and you are a member of the group. So just ensure you don't give out this code. But if eventually you fail for their trick and you give out the code, so they'll put the code right here, 867... So once they put the code because you've given it to them, then you'll be logged out of WhatsApp. Can you see that you have been logged out of WhatsApp? Now your WhatsApp will now open on their own account. So right here, they will try to like start setting up the profile. Try to like start chatting up your contacts. Probably they want to start, start scamming your contacts. Start sending them random messages. So at your end, you are logged out already. So I believe by now you are beginning to panic. Like, wow, how is this possible? What happened? Who hacked me? So just don't panic, just calmly click on login, like you should log back in. Click on login. So once you click on login at your end, you will get to click on agree and continue at your end. Just, you have to be very fast about this. You click on next. So if you're able to do this instantly, I'm very sure you should be able to recover your WhatsApp also instantly. So can you see that WhatsApp has opened on their own end? So at this point, they are trying to like chat up random people. So why you are trying to recover your account as soon as possible? So can you see? So can you see? So at this point, WhatsApp requests for a code from you. And you obviously know that you don't have access to the other phone because the hacker is already operating the other phone. So what you do is you click on need help getting the code. So right here, you click on receive SMS. Click on receive SMS. You have to be very fast about this. Click on receive SMS and click on continue. So once you click on continue, then an SMS will be sent to you instantly. So go to your SMS and input the code that was sent to your SMS. So right here, the code has arrived in our SMS. So 636598. So just go to your WhatsApp and input that 636598. 636598. The fact that you have the number to the WhatsApp, it's an advantage for you. Do you understand? The fact that you have the WhatsApp number is an advantage. So you can see that you have successfully recovered your WhatsApp. You have successfully recovered your WhatsApp, and the hacker has been logged out from WhatsApp. Can you see that right now? So that's the very first step for you to recovering your WhatsApp from hackers. So just click on next and set up your account back and this time around you want to try your best to go and set up two-step authentication do you understand two-step authentication so i'll show you how to do that right away all right can you see that successful so just quickly go to these three dots up here once you click on that go to your setting and over here you click on account once you click on account then you get to see where you get to like set your two-step verification so tap on two-step verification, then click on turn on. So once you turn this on, you get to like put a pin for yourself. Put your personal pin that you always remember. 
So once you put your personal PIN, then you get to set it up as your two-step verification. So next time, if someone is trying to access your WhatsApp, they'll be requested to input your two-step verification, which is known to only you. And that way, they will be unable to access your WhatsApp. So that is the best way to secure your WhatsApp immediately after you recover your WhatsApp. So here's another step you can follow. If for adventure you are unable to get this step, probably you did it and it did not work for you. So the next step you can follow is for it to go to your friend's WhatsApp. So let's assume this is my friend WhatsApp. So I will click on these three dots up here. So once I click on that, I'll go to setting. So once you go to setting, so over here, you just go to where you have help. You go to where you have help. So right here, you click on help center. So once you click on help center, so guys, if you're enjoying this video, please and please drop a comment in the comment section and also ensure to subscribe to my channel and like this video so that to reach out to more people that are interested in this kind of video. I really appreciate that, guys. Thanks a lot. So once you are here, then you go to where you have contact us. Can you see contact us right here? So you tap on contact us. It means you are trying to like reach out to WhatsApp. You are trying to reach out to WhatsApp and let them know what you are going through right now. So then this is connecting. So over here, they are asking you to tell us how we can help you. So just input this message you are seeing right here. Let me just input the message. So I just input the message. You can see, hello WhatsApp support. I am typing this message with a different WhatsApp account. My own WhatsApp account just got hacked and a two-step verification was activated by the hacker. So that's if you're unable to reassess your WhatsApp, just like in the previous method I showed you. And if the hacker has eventually gone ahead to input a two-step verification, then you say the phone number I used in registering for the account. Just input your phone number and also add your name to it. Then you click on next. So once you click on next, it means you are contacting WhatsApp directly. So can you see? They'll give you several options right here if any of them helps you. So you just click on send my question to WhatsApp support. So once you click on that, then it's sending. So this is the second step you can use to recover your WhatsApp. So can you see your question has been sent to WhatsApp support. We will respond in a WhatsApp chat shortly. So just go to your WhatsApp chat and they will tell you the necessary step you have to take for it to recover your WhatsApp. So can you see WhatsApp support? Instantly, they sent us a message back. Can you see? Thank you for your message. Your ticket is... So you've activated a chat with the WhatsApp support and just take your time to read through all this and they'll tell you all what you need to do for you to recover your WhatsApp. So just ensure you follow the steps that they outlined here and at the end of it all, I'm very sure that you are going to recover your WhatsApp successfully. So guys, just be careful about the links you click. Be careful about the groups you join. If the link or the group are not from a trusted source, ensure not to join such group and ensure not to click such link and also be careful of the attachments you open these are ways hackers get to like hack you on whatsapp do you understand so and also don't forget to go and put on your two-step verification so that next time if they are trying to hack you they will be restricted through that extra layer of protection you just set all right i believe you got value from this video guys and if you did ensure to subscribe to my channel ensure to like this video and also drop a comment if you actually tried this and it worked for you I'll be seeing you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.